well guys we're currently in the middle of playing throne liberty and as you can see it's high action impactful combat and we're currently cheering on my character because i can't even do anything anyways so you might as well give him moral support with the clown wig uh, so he can kill some wolves a little bit faster okay so we've been uh, playing this now for almost two hours a little bit less than two hours maybe one and a half and as you can see right now the game is playing itself i'm doing a quest right now i need to kill brutal wolves and i'm not i don't have to do anything first impression this is the worst game i've ever played and it's not even close this is just an absolute insult on every single level okay the opt i'm as you can see i'm playing on the lowest graphic settings possible because anything else doesn't work my pc isn't that great i have a 1070 ti and everything else is around that level but if i play bdo on like high settings i'm doing fine if i do anything above like media anything above low here i can't play the game and it looks way worse than bdo too right on top of that as you can see the combat is literal dog shit it's designed to be autoplay combat you cannot move while doing anything you will just stuck in place it's basically runescape combat but worse i know you probably didn't think you would ever hear that in your life but uh, it's basically runescape combat but made worse um looting system is obviously designed around pets again the entire game is kind of designed around autoplay i mean as you can see right here this is a, the full ui down here is autoplay this this thing here that you see astral hunting is what they call it the other button here is just go to a go to a random target and attack it so like even even the auto attack is kind of autoplay e like autoplay ish um the rewards you get for quests that you have to collect manually through left clicking them like this feels like a mobile game as well there's a battle pass there's a cash shop that gives you buffs which i would assume the buffs are important because then you auto play and you have a buffs up so your auto play is faster and so on right um so yeah first impressions this game is the worst shit I've ever played in my life. I'm gonna keep playing, obviously, so we, maybe there's something good to be said eventually. But so far, this is genuinely embarrassing. That 12 years of development time has gone to this. I have no idea how that happened. I have no idea what happened. I don't know why Amazon would agree to publish this. I have no fucking clue how this is even like a thing I, I, maybe i'll add one more point to this you guys remember all of the old school mmos that were like free to play like cash grabs like the you know that wanted to ride the wow hype train back in the day you know all of those free to play games game forge gaming all that trash those games are genuinely like 10 times higher quality whenever whatever than whatever this is like we have reached a point where there's a developer that is making a game for 12 years and this is what they come up with like i don't know what kind of i don't know what the hell happened but literally the free to play trash mmos that people played that couldn't afford wow back in the day are 10 times better than whatever this is and it's not even close and yeah blue protocol is delayed for this I don't know. Also, for the people curious how pay to win this game is, uh, basically, there's a battle pass that gives you, you know, a bunch of items, just like, including the actual in game main currency you get from the battle pass. If you go over here to season pass, as you can see, you get coins here, you get potions, you get, you get buff food, and I'm, I'm assuming all of this ties into the auto battling stuff, because as you can see here, the buff food is 10 minutes long. So I would guess that, you know, they want to sell you buff food that automatically refreshes itself while you're auto-playing, auto-battling, you know? And that's probably what the monetization model is. They're trying to monetize as much of the auto-battling as possible. So the more you pay, the more, you know, the more you get out of the auto-battling, basically. Yeah, thanks for watching. We will, I'll, I'll have some follow-up videos probably. 
when uh, you know when I've learned more about the game if if I if if I can bear it without uninstalling it already so yeah peace